Time to start another day in the Harvest Moon theories. Whoa! All right, let's, uh, I should probably um. Seeing as I already collected some stuff today, blah, 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 blah. get out of here, birds. Yeah, I'm watching you leave. That's right. Get off my land. It's my land, fools. Let's uh, turn on the camera a little bit so we can get the proper, you know, um, precision of these squares. It's just perfect. This is this is like next gen consoles. Actually, this is the Nintendo 64. 64 bits, buy because the 64 bits is gonna get you far. Whoa! Yeah, you know, 64 is really not gonna get you too far considering the modern day era is like 64. Psh, we do 180. Or is 128? Is that Ninja 2? Wait, 164. Yeah, it's 100. It's 128. I can do the maths. I'm good at the math. I'm good. I swear. Yeah, I figured today we'd kind of just like clean up the uh, the yard a little bit here. Get rid of some of these rocks that Papa G left behind us. I'm gonna call him Papa G because he's probably like Papa Gramps. Or I'm just gonna call him Gramps. And uh, we're gonna see how things go if I start running out of juice here. I'm probably not gonna be able to sickle all these um, all these weeds here. And uh, you're probably asking me, well, why would you use the sickle on the weeds when you can just ha? Well, the reason why is because once you use your hammers enough, or your hammers, sorry, your tools, if you use your tools enough, you will eventually start to upgrade them. And that's why you see when I kind of wind up here, I only hit it once. If you charge it up after a while, or if you level up your tools and get better with them, you can do, like, bigger and better hits. Yeah, there we go. So there's my upgrade. Hold it, and then whap. However, that does use more energy, so you probably want to use that on the bigger things like this rock here. Just one, two hits, boom! Cuts my time down in half. And if you get the third, uh, the third level up, I'm getting a little sleepy here. My guy's like, yo, dog, this is pretty tiring work. If you get the third uh, power up, I think you just hit it once. And this, like, all this pays off in the end because there's like certain events you can do. You can go mining in the winter and you can make money by collecting stuff because unless you have a greenhouse, you're not growing crops in the winter. And your money flow is going to be at a standstill unless you buy animals. This is all you got today, shipment. All right, cool. What do we get? Wow. Wow, you gave me 230 Gs. So I'm assuming those very berries are probably like 50 each. Oh, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty pooped. Yeah, I'm pretty pooped. All right. I'm assuming those very berries are at least uh, 50 each. And I have four of them, so that's like $200. And then 30 for the... The medical herb, which was kind of a rip-off. I probably should have kept that so I could eat it whenever I get tired like this. And I don't have to walk around in the fields throwing grass like this like a fool. Pants on the ground. Crazy. Yeah, I'm just going to clean up some of this. Trim the uh, hedges. Make the, uh, make the bushes look nice. Are you pissing in my lawn? You're lucky I can't bop you with the hammer, man. Because I swear, nobody pisses on my beautiful farmland. I try to keep this place. Oh my god, I just threw that off the cliff. I live on a cliff. That's dangerous. Oh well. It's time to go to bed. Have a good night's sleep. Eat some uh, munchy crunchy rolls over here. I think it's like sushi rolls. I think this is like. A oh, they're like rice cakes. Or no, they're not rice cakes. Excuse me, I need some water. I don't know exactly what those are called, but I will find out. Okay, um, oh, it's a Saturday, that's nice. Nobody does work on a Saturday, I'm pretty sure everybody's closed and doing dick all for the day, so I'm going to walk out here, going to collect some goods for the day. I'm, uh, I don't know what this is, I think this is grass. Either way, I'm going to take this berry here, it's going to be good stuff. You're fishing over here today, good, good, good way to mix it up, you know. You got a little variety in your life, variety is the spice of life. You have to change it up every now and then. If you don't, you're going to be very boring and sluggish and uh, nothing special with my life. Reality, that, that's kind of what I did today, though. I didn't do anything. I didn't I didn't go fishing, if that's kind of what you're thinking, because it's been pretty rainy and miserable here where I'm, where I'm at right now. We had uh, severe rain warnings to the point that it was like, yeah, there might be potential floods. Whoa! But luckily, I live in a high enough area in my city 
that are sort of like in my city area, province, etc., etc., that I don't have to worry about flooding, luckily. Oh. Yeah, I, I feel bad for other people to have to worry about it, because that's kind of scary. Uh, I wouldn't want to be flooded and kind of kicked out of house and home. I gotta knock on some wood here. Superstition, just in case anything happens. But either way, here's one of the first love interests you can meet in the game. This is Karen. You don't look familiar. Where are you from? Well, it doesn't matter. You'll be gone soon anyway with a little heart, so... Obviously, she's trying to play that hard to get. Like, I know you'll be gone anyways. Nobody sticks around here long enough, and... She says that because I know if you don't romance her fast enough, she will actually, like, jump ship and just take off. Um... I don't... I, I, if I remember correctly, she doesn't like living here because she lives on the, in the vineyard with her dad, her mother, and their farmhand. I'm not even trying to be racist. They have, like, a farmhand. It's pretty miserable. Take that! Yeah. Um, he's kind of like a guy who's got like, a purple bandana. I don't want to sound racist, but I think he's um, Hispanic of some sorts. Yes, this cave that looks like a vag, you can go inside of it. Ha ha ha. Ha ha, so funny. I, I get it, you're all laughing. And no, put that in your bag, and then I'm going to carry this home. I used to do this when I was a kid. This used to be the good way to get the money at the beginning of the game. Gay. Beginning of the game. I was trying to say game and day mix it all together. Oh my god. It's almost 6 o'clock. Okay, I gotta book shit. This dude's gonna show up and be like, Yeah, that's it for me today. Alrighty then, I'm just gonna leave your farm. This guy's a douchebag. I think it's like, if you don't have anything in the collection box come 6 o'clock, he just doesn't take it. Um. Oh yeah, I, I still have 530. Okay. I thought I gained money there for some weird reason. I don't know why. I'm probably just losing it. And toss this in there. No, don't chop it, damn it! Uh, what is this? Is this edible herbs? Recovers your energy a bit. Release fatigue. Okay, um, I don't know which one's better for farming. Otherwise, I would hold on to one of them. But, you know, money's more important because we're coming up to the farming festival soon. And I, I want to be. I want to be able to buy things and be like, oh, look at my pretty flowers. I'm going to go with this to all the women in the town. Yeah, my, my guy is going to be like a romancer. He's going to get all the names of all the bitches in town. He's going to get around town. Um, If I remember correctly, this is all you got today? All right, all right, cool. I'm taking it all. Bye. Stop being fatigued. I want to see how much money I made. Whoa, man. Whole 440. Is it 440? Yeah, yeah, 440, man. That's totally radical, man. Got got all the goods today. Made the monies. Now I'm gonna clean up the the, the yard because people are trying to sleep and I'm hitting things. And you can already hear the owls. I'm getting a little bit scared because it's dark outside and I don't know what to do with myself when it gets pretty dark like this. But you know what they say. The early bird gets the worm, and it's still pretty late, but it's early somewhere in the world, so I gotta do the, the, the work in the yard. Well, you know, that was pretty a pretty dark turn. Um, I'm just gonna keep chopping this. This might seem boring to you, but I wanna get this done before my guy gets, like, super tired. And then once we get everything done around here, we can start doing the fun stuff in this game. Now you're probably sitting here looking at this and saying, how the hell is this game fun? Oh, you're tired already, you pussy-ass little bitch. Batch? Batch? Yeah, you're probably sitting there thinking to yourself, how the hell is this game fun? But I guarantee you, I'm hoping it's fun to watch, but just to play, this game is fantastic. Like, anybody that's ever played the Harvest Moon series would agree this game is fantastic.